Carlton Anderson on your summer fun station, 97.5 WQBE, the rabbit station. I'm Billy Brown. Well, it turns out that Morgan Wallen had a shutdown rumors that he'd be performing at the Big Orange Block Party, which is supposed to be honoring the University of Tennessee's baseball team for winning the SEC tournament. In fact, it's not even clear if that event is going to happen. Well, what I can tell you is clear. In just a couple of minutes, we'll check in with Bob Hamilton in the WQBE Traffic Center and then kick off another No Talk triple play with Morgan Wallen next on 97.5 WQBE. Got a big job? Need machinery, equipment, or supplies for construction or agriculture? Look no further than Green's Equipment Group. Utility rental, construction, and agricultural supplies. New Holland tractors, 25 to 100 horsepower. Attachments and hay equipment, compact track loaders, skid steers, mini excavators and more contact their sales and service team today that's greens equipment group with two locations in charleston beside greens feed and seed and jim's equipment in gallup lease ohio that's greens equipment a new holland dealer there are so many words to describe panera's new chef's chicken sandwiches the chicken juicy succulent seared the brioche roll buttery and toasty the parmesan crisps crunchy tangy the secret aioli creamy and rich all those words but when you have a bite you might just be left speechless panera's new chef's chicken sandwiches enjoy one dollar delivery fee when you order on our app restrictions apply for details visit panerabread.com slash delivery info 97.5 wqbe welcomes luke bryan Raised Up Right Tour, coming June 9th to the Charleston Coliseum. Kick the dust up. Luke Bryan with special guest Riley Green and Mitchell Tenpenny. Still need tickets? Then listen for our Luke Bryan ticket stops at A to Z Outlet. That's right. Not only can you save 30 to 50% off retail, now you can win free tickets each time we're there. It's like you've been waiting on the Rapid this Saturday from 1 to 3 at A to Z Outlet on McCorkle Avenue in St. Albans. Go ahead and call me, call me. Register for free tickets plus free prizes to be given away from A to Z Outlet and your country concert leader 97.5 WQBE. Bob Hamilton's traffic brought to you by Warner Law Offices. Entered in a car accident? Call Warner Law Offices. Bobby Warner, now's the time. Call 345-6789. Thank you, gentlemen. One crash on the books from an hour ago, 1500 block of Piedmont Road here on the east end of Charleston. And you've got a disabled vehicle, 64 eastbound at the 50-mile marker at Institute, one westbound at the 46. And the westbound traffic from the Nitro St. Albans Bridge Project backed up almost to Institute. So it slows down there at the 50, 49-mile marker and expect it to be slow right on through that construction zone. The rest of the valley in good shape. We'll keep you updated with everything right here in the traffic center at 97.5 WQBE. face of cover girl heart first the latest from kelsey ballerini on your summer fun station 97.5 wqbe i'm billy brown family movie nights on magic island return back starting this evening the movie will get underway at dusk We've got inflatables fun concessions are available don't miss it family free movie night tonight on the island thank you to our sponsors family care health centers napa auto care centers group members go mart uh alfred home solutions city of charleston parks and recreation we'll see you down there on the island tonight for family movie night on magic island with 97.5 wqbe don't miss it give me a minute and we'll check your mountaineer forecast with al archer so that three mile hike 
turned into a nine-miler. Good thing McDonald's is always close by, so you can refresh with a cool frozen drink. Like new frozen Coke, frozen Fanta Wild Cherry, or frozen Fanta Blue Raspberry. Try any size for just $1.79 each. When you're out and Big Thirst hits, just remember this. It's more than a drink. It's a McDonald's drink. Ba-da-ba-ba-ba. Prices and participation may vary. Cannot be combined with any other offer or combo meal. Coca-Cola and Fanta are registered trademarks of the Coca-Cola Company. That's the sound of friends having a good time at the Friday Happy Hour at Eagle's Nest Lounge at Little Creek Golf Course in South Charleston. We all need to relax a little and wind down after a tough week. So every Friday from 4.30 to 7.30, enjoy free appetizers like wings and barbecue sliders and a cash bar with your favorite beverages. That's free appetizers every Friday Happy Hour from 4.30 to 7.30 at Eagle's Nest Lounge at Little Creek Golf Course in South Charleston. And I'm your volunteer, Sean Archer, looking around your forecast now. First day of June. We've maybe a stray shower, albeit otherwise, sky is partly cloudy and a high temperature at 88. Well, then tonight, 45% late night thunderstorm is below at 68. Tomorrow, 90% chance of locally heavy showers and storms during the day, especially afternoon, with a high of 80. 30% chance tomorrow night. Friday, partly sunny, drier, a beautiful 78 Friday. I'm Peter Rollins, just telling Archer, if you were at the station, 97.5 WQB. Sounds good. Heck, we're just getting started. Sun, fun, and just about 90. If you're working outside, stay hydrated. Jason Aldean now on 97.5. She said, baby, do you ever miss being a Summer Fun Station 97.5. WQBE, I'm Billy Brown. The number one movie over the past holiday weekend at the box office, of course, Top Gun Maverick. Over $150 million here in the States. I think nearly $300 million worldwide. Kenny Loggins, who recorded Danger Zone for the original movie back in 1986, he said he recorded a new version of Danger Zone for Top Gun Maverick, but they stuck with the old one. Give me a minute. We'll check in with Bob Hamilton. He's in the WQBE Traffic Center. Get you to your destination safely with 97.5 WQBE. Spring is sprung and you're not going to believe the deals at A to Z Outlets. Where else can you shop name brands and the things you need at 30 to 70% off the big box stores and avoid the woes, traffic and parking. A to Z Outlets with five to eight truck shipments coming in weekly. You'll find new inventory every day. Home goods, electronics, personal care items, kitchen, outdoor grilling, lawn care, toys, sporting goods, and more. A to Z outlets. Open Monday through Saturday, 9 a.m. to 8 p.m. at the former Value City Furniture, Route 60, St. Albans. Do you struggle with occasional nerve aches, weakness, or discomfort in your hands or feet? Try Nervive Nerve Relief from the world's number one selling nerve care company. Nervive contains alpha lipoic acid to relieve nerve aches, weakness, and discomfort, and B-complex vitamins to support healthy nerve function as you age. Live your life with less nerve discomfort with Nervive Nerve Relief. Learn more at NerviveHealth.com. Good afternoon. I'm Bob Hamilton in the WQB Traffic Center. One new crash of about five minutes ago, number 57, McCorkle Avenue. That is almost at Jefferson Road, right in front of the AT&T store there, past uh, Riverwalk in South Charleston. So watch out there. Interstates are in good shape, but they are doing some pothole work on the Nitro St. Albans Bridge besides the other construction. And that traffic, the westbound 64 traffic, backed up to about cross lanes right now, moving real slowly through there. Rest of the valley looking good. We'll keep you updated from the traffic center at 97.5 WQBE. Today's Fresh Country. I am calling in from work. 97.5 WQBE. USA. A mass 
shooting suspect faces a lot more charges. Lisa Brady, Fox News. A grand jury returns a 25-count indictment against 18-year-old Peyton Gendron, accused of driving three hours from home to target black people at a supermarket in Buffalo, New York. Ten people were killed, three were injured. Gendron was already charged with murder and has pleaded not guilty. But now TV station WKBW got a hold of the indictment. Gendron is now additionally charged with 10 counts of first-degree murder, 10 counts of second-degree murder as a hate crime, three counts of attempted murder, criminal possession of a weapon, and with a domestic act of terrorism motivated by hate in the first degree. Fox's Jessica Rosenthal is now due for arraignment tomorrow. President Biden telling reporters he's not sure whether Congress will act on gun reform. The White House says he's giving lawmakers space to negotiate. The man who tried to kill President Reagan in 1981 wins un conditional release from a federal judge. John Hinckley Jr. spent more than two decades in a mental hospital and had been granted an increasing amount of freedom beginning in 2003. Actor Johnny Depp, who accused his ex-wife Amber Heard of making up abuse claims, wins his libel case against her. A jury in Virginia also awarding Depp more than $10 million. The people cheering as that news broke out, probably listening to live streams as it was happening. Depp was not there in the courthouse. You can hear them chanting, John Johnny, Johnny. Fox is Mark Meredith. Deb lawyer Camille Vasquez speaking a short time ago. Today's verdict confirms what we have said from the beginning. That the claims against Johnny Depp are defamatory and unsupported by any evidence. In a written statement, Heard says a mountain of evidence wasn't enough to stand up to the, quote, power, influence, and sway of her ex-husband. She did have a partial victory with her countersuit. The jury finding Heard was defamed by hoax claims, awarding her $2 million. America is listening to Fox. Fox News. And I'm meteorologist Alan Archer looking around your forecast now. First day of June with maybe a stray shower, albeit otherwise, sky is partly cloudy and a high temperature at 88. Well, then tonight, 45% late night thunderstorm is below at 68. Tomorrow, 90% chance of locally heavy showers and storms during the day, especially afternoon, with a high of 80. 30% chance tomorrow night. Friday, partly sunny, drier. A beautiful 78 Friday. I'm Peter Ron, just telling Archer at the weather station, 97.5 WQBE. Thank you, Weather Dude. I'm Bob Hamilton in the traffic center for WQBE. One recent crash about 20 minutes ago, number 57, McCorkle Avenue. That is just past Riverwalk as you head west on McCorkle, so watch out there. And they are doing some pothole work on the Nitro St. Albans Bridge in addition to the other work. And that westbound traffic on 64 back up to cross lanes about now. So give yourself extra time if you're headed that way. Everything else in good shape. We'll keep you updated from the traffic center here at 97.5 WQBE. Thank you, Bob. Workday's done. It's time for fun. Come on, everybody. This is your summer fun station. 97.5 WQBE. Yeah, baby. Thank you, Jerry. Here's our church. Today's 24 karat country. It reminds me of summer, and everybody loves the summer. 97.5 WQBE. At the bottom of a glass. Chris Young getting a little help from Mitchell Tenpenny, who's going to be in town. Uh, one week from tomorrow, June 9th, opening up for Luke Bryan. It's going to be a great show with 97.5 WQBE. I wasn't trying to feel-